Hey guys, it's Codebuster back again with another episode of Tales from Borderlands. Let's hop right back into it. Warning. Debris collision imminent. <laughs> What debris? Is that a... Ha! <laughs> Looks like he's sleeping too. <laughs> yep, you could say that. Henderson. Oh no. Not... Scooter. No shit! Tell us something we don't know. Did you know? <laughs> so this is how I die. Can you fix it? I knew it. I knew it. Is it something you can fix? Regrettably, not in my current state. The damage is too severe. This ship requires additional thrust. Right. Without the additional thrust, the ship will be pulled uh, back towards Pandora. Well, am I, Look, aren't I closer to, to the moon now? Right here, and y'all are in luck because that's so, my special. Gravity. Now turn them other rockets up to eleven. Boost! Oh yeah! We're gonna burn! Oh man, I got like 50 lines I wanna say about full thrust. Scooter! Why is the whole ship shaking? Yeah. No, that's just because we're running real high right now. Like, kind of scary high. But what? We're gonna take it to the limit. Okay, uh -huh. we're about to hit a sky velocity. And when we do, you gotta shut these puppies down, you hear? Uh. Yeah, yeah, I hear. Do you? How can you hear anything? Achieving you heard that. Okay. So then, why are the alarms still going? Now that was just step one. We can't do step two without step one. Uh huh. Uh, what does that mean? They're going to explode. Uh. Step two, let's do this! Uh, when are they gonna explode? Very soon. Uh huh. Step two. Step two! We get out there and we handle these uncooperative rockets. How? Oh, right. How? Step three is us making out. Oh, uh, no, 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 huh? no, 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 no. What? No. Huh. Actually, right, don't you worry, you're pretty little. Yeah, all of you, yeah, look at yourself. But I'll be walking you through it, though. Uh huh. Great. Uh, wouldn't that have just let all the air from the cabin out? Okay. Be careful, Fee. Yes, that paint job. <laughs> That's right. Easy does it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> can, I, can I watch the paint job some more? <laughs> Why did I go that way? <laughs> They go that way, but whatever. Forward. That's right. Easy does it. Word. Gonna get there. Now, what do I do? I feel like I've totally worked on a rocket before. That was step two. Right. The button wedged all the way in the back. Oh, you got it. All right. So I was, why didn't you? No. What? <laughs> when you press it, you gotta pull your arm out real quick, cause it's gonna clamp down some fierce. You got me? Uh huh. You're almost there. Damn it! You can't try this. It 
rockets bit up. Left rocket stable, Fiona. Okay. All right. Now pull the last to detach that sucker while we still can. If they were gonna explode anyways, why do we have to hit the button when we could have just detached it? We could have just detached it. Awesome. Now get your ass over to my side. Make it fast. Why? <laughs> oh. Scooter. No. <laughs> can do step two without step one, right? No. Guess my arms aren't quite as long as I thought. Scooter. Ha have Loaderbot come over and help. Guys, Try it open. that rocket's at critical. You gotta hurry. <laughs> no compensating on this one. I can't reach it. No. No, I, I can pull you out. Listen, there ain't nothing you can do. No, Scooter. No. Uh, what's going on out no. there? No. Don't you worry. Fiona's got this. Hey. <sighs> Scooter. Hey. You gotta go over there, pull that latch, and cut this rocket loose. There's no time for anything else, you understand? I'm not leaving no, you. I am not leaving you. That is not an option. That's the only option, alright? No. no. Fiona, look at me. This baby's gonna blow, okay? That is happening. And you can't be here when it does. Now, don't you go feeling all sorry for me, alright? People on Pandora will be talking about an old scooter for a long time. Scooter? Can't think of a more epic way to go. You're a hero. You should be so lucky. You're a hero. You know that, right? I kinda am, huh? You are? Well, it feels good. Right Rocket is way past critical, guys! Yes! I have to. Uh... <laughs> because Scooter... Dying wish. I gotta catch a ride. You can't see me right now. Saluting him off. Scooter, why? Alright, y'all. This is probably the end, but you see Moxie or Ellie, you tell him I did some awesome shit. Okay? <laughs> it's been real. Scooter, why? One of the first people you meet in the first Borderlands, or not really meet, but you hear say something establishes his character and whatnot. Got your ride, Scooter Man. Damn it! If I wouldn't have brought him. That was the first casualty of the mission. Scooter. I shouldn't have brought him. My fault. So, what did you do next? We honored Scooter. What did we do? We honored him as best we could. He truly earned this. It's the least we can do. Yes. Make it something good. It's the least we can do. Catch a ride. Catch a ride the scooter, man.
I know what it is like to lose someone you care about. The worst part is... Scooter was the best of us. He deserves so much better. He was definitely one of the nicest people I met on Pandora. Although that's not probably saying much. Anyway, we didn't have much time to mourn and all that. Things started to get crazy the minute we landed on Helios. Oh, uh, Scooter. So, uh, if that's not it, um, answering. Perfect. You have entered Hyperion airspace. Identify yourselves immediately. Okay, gang. <laughs> Here we go. I repeat, identify yourselves or you will be shot down. Do not come any closer. Howdy, gents. Miss me? You must have balls of steel showing your face back here. Huh? Ah, you're a gem. Well, I missed you guys, too. Big time, because I am Hugo Vasquez, and I miss guys that I miss. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we definitely have some catching up to do. What? Someone else now in charge? Is it the guy who had the psychos in the beginning? Security? Come to meet me on the docks. After I get inside and disable security, I'll call you when it's safe to come out. Time to put on the game face. You've got some things to answer for. Vasquez. Almost seems like, uh... What's the word? Providence? Tweedledick. Well now, if it isn't cock knock and Tweedledick, how's about you get out of my way and let me go do my job? Yep. I really hope I get an excuse to kill you. Uh, <laughs> are to verify what the hell you were doing down on Pandora. Yeah, take it easy, guys. I just landed. In a hunk of Pandoran trash, no less. With half a loader bot stuck to the top. Yep. <laughs> And what's that thing you dropped say? Catch a... Uh... Whatever the hell it says, it was a doll satellite. Now I suggest you start telling the truth before I blow your head off. So, what were you doing down there? Not too often the top brass venture to that dirt pile. I was dealing with the Reese and, uh, Vaughn situation. The who and what situation? Reese and Vaughn, the two criminal masterminds who had the gall to try to rip off the corporation that nurtured them. One of them's really handsome. Other's oh, a nerd. Huh. Sounds made up. Yeah, but I got, you know, very important places to be. So I'll just be... on my way. Nah. Nah. What do you mean, nah? Here's how it is. You come up here full of piss and bullets with some made-up story about Reese and Vaughn characters. So no, you're not going anywhere. Uh -huh. I'll take it from here. Hey, Matt, so good to see you. We need to catch up. Bring it in for testing. What the hell happened to Reese? This is unbelievable. It wasn't supposed to go down like this. Could we talk somewhere that's less exposed? Uh -huh. We're fine right here. I'd like to shed more light on the situation. The situation is that you brought Reese back in pieces. I All right, guys, that's this episode. So I'm going to end it right here. Catch you next time. Peace out.